Alright, welcome to the weird and wonderful lab of Michael Ellis. Um, sorry I, I didn't write it down, but, um, I was looking, this is actually my second or third take of this video. Um, I didn't write it down, um, so this, this circuit, um, the core heart of the circuit, I actually took from a book, uh, it's a Navy electronics training manual uh it's the um the like wiring and um wiring and connections or something one and it, it actually came from the car uh ignition system um but uh it actually works uh when it's disconnected as a battery maintainer uh, because it's like uh like a secretly free energy circuit <laughs> So, um, anyways, um, basically what this circuit does is it's a battery maintainer. So, um, so you have a, you have a, um, have a, a battery hooked up to the uh, ignition coil and capacitor, uh, and, and a diode, which I added. Um, and it basically keeps the battery charged when you're not using it. And when you're using it, oddly enough. Uh, now I I don't have it like super loaded down, uh, but I did do an experiment where I added a battery, a uh, uncharged, bat light a uh, life life pole or whatever, um, a lithium, uh, uh, potassium ferrite one, um, uh, uh, what you call it a battery <laughs> a battery, um, you know the iron 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 lithium phosphate battery um and it was uncharged and i hooked it up in parallel to the fully charged battery and it charged the lithium battery and it didn't detriment the system at all it just charged it just charged it up and out of while running a bunch of leds i even added more leds on to further bog the system down and it managed to charge up the battery which was like a like a six and a half amp hour one um it managed to charge the batteries while while running more leds up to the same level as the um as the battery was before adding all this crap on so um so yeah so uh, it this does work uh, pretty freaking well so um so 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 I made this circuit, which is an LED driver. Uh, the LEDs aren't really bright on it, but they're at it, it's like near their recommended current, anyways. For the for the bright white LEDs, of course, I added on um, just in series uh, some some uh, uh, what you call it um, some uh, chunks of I don't know what else I call it. Um, there's some bunches of um, blue and white one, blue and red ones, and I'll probably add on some like or change out the bright white ones, or add just add a more on. I don't know. I'll just add more on because it it doesn't seem to um, affect the battery at all. Um, some uh, worm light ones. Actually, what I need to do is get brighter LEDs or something. I don't know because these don't seem to be doing anything at all towards uh lighting up for plants or whatever um they just seem like moonlight basically at this point so yeah you can germinate plants under them but you can't actually grow plants under them so um so yeah so um so this is yeah i just didn't get bright enough leds but um so this is an led driver um circuit um, it's for, oops, sorry, my chair's squeaky. Um, so, so this is a battery maintainer with an LED driver circuit kit on it. But really, you could run, this is the LEDs, or these are the LEDs, rather. And, um, so this is the LEDs por portion of the circuit. So this is our load, uh, for the most part. This could be any load you want to continuously run while your batteries are being maintained. Um, just a low impact load. This is a low impact load. I don't know if it, I, 
I could try running a motor or fan or something to see if it will actually keep the battery charged while it's doing that. But I just have LEDs on it right now to just see if it could like maintain LEDs, which it can. It's like seven and seven uh, in this diagram right out four and four, which should be a little bit brighter than seven. Because the more more you add on, the more the the less bright they become, or the duller they become. Um, dimmer, dimmer. That's the word I'm looking for. Um, so yeah, so um, so so I added chunks of LEDs or groups of LEDs in series. Um, so uh, so this is basically how you add them. You add the the uh, the resistor and the LED, and then they're in parallel, so they get the same uh, voltage treatment. Um, and then another chunk of another. Sorry, I keep saying chunk. Um, yeah, whatever. Another group of LEDs in series. Um, so you get the 12 volts distributed around to like 20 milliamps is, is the goal for the bright white LEDs. Uh, and then an uh, extra resistor on there. Um, and uh, the battery, so that's the, that's the load uh, part of the circuit. Um, the, the LED driver. Now the battery maintainer circuit, the part I pulled out of the, um, the Navy manual, um, is a battery, uh, so like a car battery. Oh, this I added, the, um, the diode, rectifying diode, 10A10, rectifying diode. I added that on to, um, to just, if there's anything like floating around, like oscillations floating around, to just use that to recharge the battery. Um, because I did measure with my uh, uh, multi multimeter, multimeter, multimeter. Um, I did matter ma message. I did. Me sorry, I did measure um, twenty seven volts AC uh, in this circuit. So I don't know what that was. I I should get my oscope hooked up and look at it. But anyways, um. Uh, battery, resistor, um, ignition coil, positive, negative to a capacitor to gr a chassis ground, high voltage comes up and goes to the load. And you're not actually, oops, sorry. You're not actually, um, getting a high voltage out of it because you're not, um, you're not actually, uh, whatchamacallit, um, you're not actually, like, oscillating the, the coil at all. So this just runs as a, um, as a choke sort of deal. Um, or, like, a circuit stabilizer. Um, but, yeah, so, um, so that's it. That's all there is to it. It's really the simplest circuit in the world, but, um, in that combination, it keeps everything lit and running um, for like indefinitely. So you can add as many batteries on as you want and they'll all stay powered as long as the load doesn't overpower them. So that's it. Thanks for watching. This is Michael Ellis. Free, feel free to try building this and share your results. I would love to see them. Comments below. If you see, if you know, think of any improvements uh, on the circuit to make it work better so we can maybe grow plants for free indoors um, let's just 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 a uh, driver like this and water um, won't, won't need sunlight uh, can use maybe use some commercial LED sort of deals sort of deals um, just by hacking into them and hooking the LEDs directly up to this. Maybe that will work, maybe it won't. So uh, don't sue me if it doesn't work. So uh, that's your disclaimer. Um, anyways, uh, thanks for watching. This is Michael Ellis. Stay safe and be careful. Don't get electrocuted and have a nice day. See you later.